big people can't be wrong. That's right. <laughs> Bring them on in. <laughs> ah. Hey, these, people, these people are excited for a sword fighting show. Yes, right? um, what time is it? Does anyone know the time? 27. 27. We can start early, I think. Oh, I don't know, sir. I don't know. Lord Delaney. Ask them. Out of curiosity, how many of you yes. would like to watch me stab him in the head? <laughs> my people. Wait, what? I'm just back here minding my own business. All right, fine, fine, fine. Out of curiosity, how many of you would be just as all right with me stabbing him in the head? <laughs> well, no, the, we the crowd is full. <laughs> And bloodthirsty, <laughs> sir. Yeah. Well, I guess we should give them what they want. Which is? How about you? Ah! Yeah. Bah! Bah! Yeah. Bah! 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 Hold still. Nope. <laughs> 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 I had it. Yeah. 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 Oh. All right. <laughs> Yes. Ah! 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 He said, "Go away." Go away. <laughs> he brought his own sword to the sword fighting I show, know, right? <laughs> Actually, I'm all right. You? Uh, we're role models, apparently. <laughs> <laughs> How about you? Ah! 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 Kill you! Kill you first! Die! Ah, you die! You! Uh -huh. I have you. you! Get over! I, I can't I, reach. What, what is this? <laughs> what are you doing? What are you doing? I feel like a T-Rex. <laughs> <laughs> sir! What? This is getting us nowhere. And fast. Good point. Uh, the crew, sir. Oh yeah, right. <clears throat> Lords and ladies, allow me to introduce myself. I am Captain Red Swash Rogers. And I am Bosun Punk Buckle. And together we are... Buckle, Buckle and Swash! Swash. Yeah. By the power of Grayskull. Right. <laughs> now then, you all came here today to see a sword fighting show. And, as you know, sword fights occur for only one of three reasons. Reason number one, money. You there, sir! Give me $74.36 or I'll stab you. Whoa, 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 whoa. That is a very specific number. I have things in my Amazon cart. <laughs> Reason number two, romance. You there. Hello. <laughs> Give me your phone number or I'll stab you. Whoa, whoa, Wait, whoa, whoa, whoa. That is not appropriate. No, I'm not sorry. okay. I'm sorry. <laughs> Reason number three, honor. <laughs> oh, that's rich. Honor, have you met us? I know, right? <laughs> so actually, we're going to stick to the first one. <clears throat> and to that end, after the show, Mr. Punt and I will be standing about, passing our treasure chests. If you would, please stop by and say hello. And, you know, if you can, maybe drop in a couple of bucks. You know, maybe a five. Or ten. Or a twenty. Or a puppy. Or a... With a 20, we could just buy a puppy. Or, or 20 puppies? But I, I just really want a puppy, sir. I'm so lonely. Aww. Oh no, do not encourage him. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, we would love to see you all after the show. <laughs> I, wait, wait, wait. I just have an invisible puppy. That's <laughs> all I have, sir. <laughs> <laughs> sir! Yes. Do you know what time it is? <laughs> it's not puppy time, I'll tell you. Uh, more's the pity, sir. <laughs> oh! You mean it's pirate story time. Everybody? Ooh. Everybody? Ah. Everybody! <laughs> hey, they actually did it. Nice. <laughs> Score. Well, as I am the captain, I shall tell the very first pirate story. Very well, as your crew, your entire crew, very good. I will assist you. Good thing. <laughs> Our story begins like all good stories. It was a dark and stormy night. Boom! Crash! Flash! Bah! You! Take out the garbage! What? No! I'm not gonna do that! Yes, you will! I ain't doing nothing! As long as you live under my roof, you'll do exactly as I say! That was a dark and stormy night at my house. 
I think we've all learned a little something. <laughs> well, there we were, Mr. Punt and I, spending a nice, quiet evening home alone. Not sure whose home it was, but it was very nice. Yes. <laughs> Oh, it was a lovely little B and D. Uh, no, I think you mean B and B, sir. No, oh, no, I don't. <laughs> <laughs> oh, good, all the felons laughed. Thank I don't you. Know. <laughs> I don't know. Huh? <laughs> well, there we were when suddenly there came a knock at the door. Bing bong. Bing. Oh, sorry. Right, sorry. Thank you. <laughs> I, <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Well. Mr. Punt slowly opened the door. <laughs> Can you use some oil on these hinges, sir? <laughs> Out there, in the darkness, silhouetted in the lightning's flash. Lightning flash, sound effect! <laughs> think lightning, there was a, lightning sounds a lot like a kid yelling. <laughs> think, think there's a lion out there. <laughs> it's a fox, sir. Oh, it's a fox, very good. Well, out there, there was a hideous, a grotesque, a horrible, an evil, a scab encrusted, foul smelling, pus oozing, puppy eating. Ooh, puppy eating is really good. <laughs> horrible, horrible sea hag. And the sea hag just so happens to be sitting right here. Let's give it up to the sea hag. Just stand up where you are, sir. Just stand up where you are. Stand up. Just stand up, sir. Now then, when the sea hag arrived, she let loose with a hideous cackle. Hideous cackle! <laughs> I picked the guy that practices at home. Yeah. <laughs> well, the sea egg sent us on a quest to find the forbidden jewel of Jambalaya. Everybody? Everybody? Everybody! <laughs> yes. <laughs> Well, she gave us a map where we could find where the treasure was buried, but warned us not to look into the gem because it was cursed. Tell him it's cursed. The gem. It's cursed. Yeah, tell him like you mean it. The gem. It's cursed. <laughs> He's a ventriloquist, apparently. <laughs> where did he go for it? The gem is cursed. Okay, I believe you. <laughs> Shatner esque. I know. <laughs> oh my god, the gem is cursed. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> With that, the sea egg let loose another hideous cackle <laughs> and disappeared into the night. A round of applause for our sea hag. Ah, that's good sea hagging. Indeed it was. <laughs> well, we followed the map and found where the treasure was buried. <laughs> Mr. Punt unearthed a treasure chest. <laughs> he slowly opened the lid. E Can you use some oil on these hinges too, sir? <laughs> He opened the lid, and inside he discovered another treasure chest. Oh, man. Weird. That's the greatest treasure of The greatest treasure of all was the chest we found. More treasure, right? right? It's like wishing for uh, more wishes. He opened that treasure chest, and inside he discovered another treasure chest. I did not see that coming. <laughs> He opened that treasure chest, and inside he discovered the oh, no, no, no. <laughs> What a surprise! <laughs> he opened that treasure chest, and inside he discovered... Wait! Oh. Sir, wait, it's it! Oh, we've done it! We found it! It's the Forbidden Jewel of Jambalaya! Well, whatever you do, Mr. Punt, do not look into the gem because it is cursed. Don't worry, sir, I won't. <laughs> and by I won't, I mean I already have. With that, Mr. Punt let loose a shriek of terror. E <laughs> Apparently, Punt needs oil, too. <laughs> well, the curse of the gem was none other than to fill the viewer with an insatiable bloodlust and cause them to attack with murderous frenzy the very next person they laid their eyes upon. It... <laughs> oh, poopy. Die! Oh, what a ah! I'll kill you dead! <laughs> Wait, is there really any other way to kill me? Uh, well, let's find out. Let's stop. Ah! <laughs> ah! 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 
Ow! My soft spot. Oh, you actually got me that time. <laughs> <laughs> Get to the chopper! Wait! Wait, sir, wait, no, sir, wait, sir. Uh, you can't kill me, sir. Why not? Uh, uh, because, sir, because right now we're inside a flashback. You can't kill me inside the flashback or I won't be alive at the, at the start of the flashback to where you kill me inside of the flashback. It's just science, sir. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you! I hate time travel. <laughs> Motion carries. <laughs> Sir, besides! What? You got to tell your pirate story. Uh -huh. I should get to tell my pirate story, right, everyone? Yeah! Tell you what, that's only fair. Thank you. I'll tell you later. Uh, thank you? You're welcome. <laughs> I will tell my tale. The tale of how I defeated the evilest nastiest pirate in the entire world. You don't mean... I do mean the evil, fluffy, huggable Steve. Uh, okay, he's a lot scarier than his name makes him sound. Right. But I remember it, sir, like it was just last week. Why is that? Because it was just last week. Uh, I had been chasing him for months. Finally, his ship was there in front of me, trapped. Where? Out there. <laughs> Lake Pontchartrain. <laughs> his ship, the... the blah 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 I... <laughs> that is a really weird name for a ship. What? No, no, no. I just don't remember the name of his ship. Oh, uh, but my ship, the something or other, was... Wait! <laughs> you don't remember the name of your own ship? No, that's its name, the something or other. <laughs> so the blah de blah blah and the HMS something or other got into a fight. Is that so hard to believe? Yes. <laughs> Listen, listen, listen. He was shouting orders to his men. He was all, uh, yada, yada, yada. And then I was shouting orders to these men. I was all, uh, blah, 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 blah. Wait, you were shouting the name of his ship. No, I was just saying something or other. You were shouting the name of your ship. No, I was just giving orders. Everyone was very confused. Third base. <laughs> I don't know. Don't you speak English? I really thought I did. Listen. <laughs> He was shouting orders to his men. He was all yada, 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 and the blah, 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 blah. And then I was all blah, blah, and the something or other. And then he let out his war cry. Let me guess. It was yada, yada, yada. And we locked swords. Ah, ha! Thank you. Uh, 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 ever, you are. Ooh, I, wait uh, a minute. I, am I playing you or am I playing him? Oh, uh, oh, you're playing him, playing me, playing you, playing him. I <laughs> It doesn't make any sense. Do we ever make sense? Hip <laughs> the ah. ah. Oh, I almost got you in the glute. Fool you, I had my glute removed. <laughs> How the heck do you sit? Oh. You're using that wrong. <laughs> Oh, oh, I'm tired. Oh, boy. I was hot, out late last night. Hot, but I thought. I need the beer tasting. Oh, jeez. Um, I need that. Too bad. <laughs> Wait! Mr. Punt. Hey! I told my pirate story. Hey? You told your pirate story. Hey? Now it's time for our crew to tell their pirate story. Right, everyone? Good thinking, sir! Hey. We need your help to tell the tale of our very first pirate captain, the amazing slashing dashing Steve. No relation to fluffy huggable Steve. Pure coincidence. Weird. Oh, Steve, he was brave. He was noble. He was wise. He was courageous. He was strong. He was handsome. And he's sitting right here. Let's hear it for slashing dashing Steve. <laughs> Come on up, Steve. Come on up. Steve, 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 Steve. 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 Right here, my friend. Right there, see? 
This is the tale of how Slashing Dashing Steve found the greatest treasure in all the world and was able to finally retire from piracy. One fine day, Steve set out to find the greatest treasure known to man. Come on, Steve, let's set out to find the greatest treasure known to man. We're gonna sail right past that speaker and then far away to the back of the audience where we can't hear what they're saying. All right. I do not know what the greatest treasure is and neither do they. I am going to get what that treasure is from suggestions from all of you and then using only mime and gibberish, I'm going to get Steve to guess what that treasure is. Let me turn this off so we can't hear. So not too loud, because he's right over there. The greatest treasure in all the world is something you might buy at a yard sale. What is it? Peanuts. A, a Furby. Grandpa. Oh, it's a Furby. But this is not an ordinary Furby. This is the golden Furby that used to belong to somebody famous, either living or dead. Who owned it? Harry Potter. Was that? Abraham Lincoln. Well known that he had a Furby. All right. All right. Now then, it is hidden somewhere strange and bizarre. Where is it? Louisiana. Right, give me a geographical location. By something strange and exotic that would not normally guard a trip. I get Michael Jackson all the time. Maybe, maybe a creature that would not normally guard a trip. A pelican. It's a pelican. All right, just to review, he's going after the golden Furby of Abraham Lincoln, where it's hidden in Mount Rushmore and guarded by a ferocious pelican. I am going to get Steve to guess all of those things uh, using no words, only mime and gibberish. So please do not shout out the answers. We want to see if Steve can guess on his own. So on the count of three, everybody yell, Steve, come back. Ready? One, two, three. Steve, come back! Now, as he gets each one of these four things right, I need you all to yell, scream, cheer, applaud, and go completely out of your minds because it's gonna be a miracle. <laughs> Slashing Dashing Steve had been sailing the seas for years, looking for the greatest treasure known to man. Yeah. 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 Along the way, he picked up a strange and mysterious witch doctor. A man who spoke no English. But he knew everything there was to know about the treasure. All right, I'll translate for you, sir. I was going to be, 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 I say, boop, 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 I was going to be, I say, I get do 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 do. I get skidoo be. I skidoo be. I say. Oh. I get skidoo be. I get skidoo be. I flip flip flip. I say. Ah. Ooh. 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 That horrid creature <laughs> found in, in children's rooms sometimes. <laughs> Practically possessed, almost. <laughs> um, uh, it's, you know, it's a, uh, oh, 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 uh, you remember what it was. Of course you do. Uh, it was, in fact, it was covered in, in hair. What's another word for hair? It was covered in what? Oh. Yeah, yeah. Uh, what was the creature we were looking for? The thing? Sasquatch. Uh, no, 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 no. Uh, uh, oh, ah, you know that, that, that delightful uh, insect that the whole world needs to exist. That uh, that pollinates everything. Ah, the bumblebee. Uh, yes. Uh, so what was it? What was it covered in? Fur. And what was the animal? The bee. Uh, so what? What were we looking for? Furry bee. Oh, it's so close. <laughs> <laughs> it was one thing. It was yeah. called a bee. Uh, what kind of bee? Bumblebee. Uh, nope, not that kind of bee. Uh, no, no, uh, it wasn't a bee. It wasn't actually a bee. It wasn't actually a bee. But it was a creature that kind of maybe sounds like that. And it was co not covered in hair, it was covered in fur. And it was a bird. Oh, so close. <laughs> Maybe it was a bee. <laughs> uh -huh. <laughs> All right. Um, take, uh -huh. take those two things, stick them together. <laughs> what was it covered in? 
fur. Uh huh. And what kind of what's the insect? A bee. Uh huh. Stick it together. Literally stick it together. Furby. <laughs> yeah. Oh, good yeah. Job. yeah. Let him find out his own. He right. got it. He's he got it. Right. Uh, uh, a Furby. Right. Uh, a Furby. 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 Ah, who owns the golden Furby? Uh, I'm a Suitabi. I get Suitabi. I get Suitabi. Oh, that's good. I get Suitabi. I get Suitabi. I get Suitabi. Point. Oh, I get Suitabi. Oh, that's good. 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 Oh, that's Oh, what? Too soon? Is it a friend of yours? <laughs> you remember who owned that golden Furby, right? Oh, the 16th one of them. Wait, wait, why, wait, why does he have a sword? He doesn't put that away. You get it right, you'll get your sword back. <laughs> you remember who owned the golden Furby, right? Yes, yes, that, of that, that, that man of great stature. Yes. He was, in fact, a very tall man. Uh, the, the, from Illinois, even. Um, uh, it, it was, there was 15 of them came before him. Um, uh, he was in charge. He was in charge of this, of this, of this land. It's on the $5 bill. It's on the $5 bill. Yes, yeah, yes. Um, uh, you're not so good with the history bit. Sorry. All right. <laughs> no, it's all right. It's all right. Um, uh, what's that? Uh-uh, uh-uh. Yeah, all right, all right, all right. Um, uh, who's in charge of this land? What's the what's that title? The, uh, no, no, no. The, the land in charge of the this this land. The, the, uh, uh, even uh, bigger, uh, even bigger. Uh, yes, uh, yes. The sixteenth uh, uh, one of those. Well, <laughs> big tall hat, <laughs> beard, but no mustache. Yes. yes! There you go. There you go. Nice. Very good. Oh boy. Uh, <laughs> it's been a while. It has. It's been like an hour. <laughs> Who do you think it's true to me? Ah, it where it was hidden. Ah, I think it's true to me. Ah, I think it's true to me. Ah, I think it's true to me. Ah, uh huh. I think it's true to me. Tick, 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 uh, uh, there, there was uh, other presidents. There was four of them uh, arranged in a big, a big face. Uh, which is what? What's that? What's that? That place called? Uh, uh, you're close. You're close. You're so close. Uh, it, it's it is sort of a a, a monument. Um, uh, but it is uh, uh, if 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 you if you're busy, you're in a. You're very busy. Yes. There it is. Nice. You're doing great. Oh boy. Oh, the Guardian. Uh oh. Um. Yeah, I gotta remember. Hang on. All right. Let me see. Uh, uh, uh. Like a Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Ah, I see me. Sploosh. Ah. Oh, the Guardian of the Treasure. I have sploosh, sploosh, sploosh. I have bloop. Oh, are you sploosh? Bloop. I can see the biggest thing. So bloop. Oh, it's getting up. 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 Oh, it's the guardian of the treasure was a, a, a mighty beast. There's a lot of them around here, apparently. In fact, you sometimes even name sports teams after them. <laughs> you know, uh, it, it scoops up fish with its mighty gullet thing. <laughs> uh, I love, but it's airborne. Where? But it's scooped. Yes! Oh, my God. Yes, of course. All right, in the center there, Steve. In the center. Now put it all together. Was a golden Furby. Uh huh. Discovered. Belong to? Who did it belong to? Abraham Lincoln. Yeah. Uh huh. In Mount Rushmore. Uh huh. And the Guardian was a pelican. Yes! Flashy <laughs> Gosh! Take the ball! Take the ball! You will go back to your seat. Well done, well done. Well done. Spectacular. Yeah. And that yeah. is the tale. <laughs> Steve! Before you go, Steve. Here. Wait, wait, wait! Steve, protect it's yourself. Not it's not over yet! Hey, wait, what? No, that's how he. You must still face me. What? 
<laughs> the evil pelican. What? <laughs> a pelican? I have to fight a pelican? Yeah, you are so doomed. Ah! I got you. Ah! 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 At least you're not a goose. Ah! Ah! Oh, there is no fighting the goose. Ah! 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 I'm gonna cut your face bag off. Oh no! <laughs> You're a face bag. Oh! <laughs> Sick bird. <laughs> Wait! And that is how Slashing Dashing Steve defeated the evil pelican, got the golden Furby of Abraham Lincoln out of Mount Rushmore, managed to sell it on eBay, and made enough money to retire to Covington. <laughs> Flashing, dashing, Steve! <laughs> Lords and ladies, I am Captain Red Swash Rogers. I am Bosun Butt Buckle. That is Slashing, dashing, Steve. And together we are... Buckle, Buckle and, and Swash! Thank, thank you. you. <laughs> Lords and ladies, thank you so much for joining us. We'll be standing out with our treasure chest. This really is how we make our living. If you would drop in a couple of bucks, we also have a QR code if you'd like to do the PayPal thing. We also have our t-shirts available in all sorts of sizes. It's our bunny logo with the phrase, attempted murder, but like funny. So stop on by, say hello. Thank you all and enjoy the rest of your festival day. Thank you, buddy. Thank you, Take care, much. thanks for coming. And kids, if you like the sword fighting, go home and practice on your parents. Thank you, guys. They like that sort of thing. Take care, thanks for coming to the show. Uh, it's funny. Take care.